Hello guys and girls and welcome back to whatever the fuck this is And today <laughs> I'm gonna give you the four main reasons why people will subscribe to you Man, it's going to single fucking digits. It is freezing. <laughs> and it's only going to get worse. Oh, they just hate it when it gets to this time of year, man. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Fuck it. All right, guys and girls. Number one is you are relatable. You know, we all do the same thing. We're all, we've all got the relatability of being on a motorbike anyway. But hey, if you see someone riding the same roads you do, doing the same type of things you do, well, oh, better watch out. Go on, son. You see people doing the same things that you do, riding the same type of roads that you do, talking about the same type of things that you do, then that means that you are relatable. And people can see that in themselves. People have mentioned it on my videos, you know. I can see what you do. <laughs> the commuting, the filtering, the raging. <laughs> I don't rage that much, do I? But if you are relatable, then your audience will like you even more because they'll see something in you that they see in themselves. You know, you just like them. And if you can be relatable, then you'll get people in. So that is number one. Be relatable. Whee! All right, now number two is you give them something. Be it information, skills, knowledge. I'm doing the whole passing on information to people about YouTube, about analytics, about SEO, about branding, marketing, mainly YouTube. And I've seen my subscriber count jump, so <laughs> you know what I'm saying is true. <laughs> if you give someone something, then they will more likely subscribe to you and come back for more. This can be translated for motorbikes, as in uh, if you can do. If you're one of these. DIY types, one of these, you know, one of these mechanic-y type people. And you can do the basic shit, like basic servicing and basic, you know, like how to change your brake pads. If you do it, you could do an entire series. How to change brake pads, how to do all this basic stuff, how to change brake pads, how to change clutch cables, how to change throttle cable, how to, you know, how to clean your brakes. If you can do a series like that, I guarantee you that you will, you know, get people over to you. Because people are searching for that kind of stuff, you know. If you can save money for, for bikers, which is what a lot of them like. Damn. <laughs> That's a wrong turn in there, mate. If you can save bikers money, because bikers are tight asses, to be honest with you. I'm, not, I'm just saying, bikers are tight asses. Like, if you can help people by giving them something for free, then you always get people over. Always, always, always. If you can teach people about the programming you're using, you don't have to be fucking fantastic at it. But if you can teach people the basics, people love learning about the basics and then into more advanced stuff as you learn more advanced stuff. There's a whole plethora of things you can do being a motor vlogger. I don't want to my voice then. <laughs> There's a whole plethora of things you can do. Oh, come on! You've not got a fucking tank! Jesus, wept! Fuck me, you know what I'm saying? Some people drive the cars like they've got a fucking massive 32 ton lorry or some shit, don't they? Oh, what the fuck's going on, man? Seriously? Anyway, fuck it, that is number two. If you give someone something for free, information, skills, knowledge, whatever, cutting the line, dick, <laughs> then they will come back for more. Number three? is uh, the most powerful one. Number three is belief. If you believe in something, the same as someone you're watching, you are fucking way more likely to subscribe to them. It kind of goes hand in hand with relatability. If you have the same beliefs as someone, this could be religious if you want, it could be life beliefs, you know, what, what you aspire to be, what you want other people to believe in. They might believe in the same thing as you, you know. Like for my channel, is now about teaching others. Not, well, not teaching. Teaching sounds very preachy, doesn't it? But informing others, we'll say. Yeah, we'll say informing others. My channel's about informing others and uh, helping people make their YouTube channels better, make their videos better, make their overall content better. Because I think that everyone, everyone on YouTube has the potential to be a million-plus subscriber person. They really do. 
they've just got to get the information and knowledge and experience to become that and it's where a lot of people um it's what a lot of people don't know about so you know if you don't know about it you're not going to find out about it so i'm going to spread the information what i have about marketing and branding and seo and social media and all that type of stuff in the hopes that it'll help other people grow their channels and you know spread whatever message they want to spread so that's my belief is what i'm going to do and there's already a few a few of you out there who believe that you know what i'm doing is right and helpful which is what it comes down to is being helpful that's all it, if you boil it down to its core my th the thing what i'm doing it's helping others so if you believe that helping others is something worthwhile and someone else does the more likely to subscribe to you here's how here's how i can explain that belief is one of the most powerful things okay you try and convince someone who supports uh, arsenal i'm going to english football here i don't know american football miami dolphins is that right i'm not too sure jets is that right <laughs> you convince someone who supports arsenal i'll try and convince someone who supports arsenal that tottenham is better or you try and convince someone who supports chelsea that liverpool is better you you go and try and convince them that i guarantee they will almost try and kick your head in <laughs> and call you an absolute dickhead and that's just football you know if you take it to religion <laughs> uh oh i'm gonna get fucking murked here if you take it to religion, you try and convince someone who is Catholic that Buddhism is better. I'm not going for the big one. You try and convince someone who is Catholic that Buddhism is better and that Catholicism is a sham, it's a lie. See what happens. You won't fucking change the mind. So belief is one of the most powerful things in the world. And then it comes to the last one, which is aspirational. Ah, I should look at the sun when I say that. Aspirational. Ah, if you have something that people want then they will subscribe to you simple as that if you have a nice bike say a, a thousand double r people aspire to have that sort of thing if you have hundred thousand subs people will aspire to have that and so they'll more likely come towards you they'll gravitate towards you because they want that they want the nice bike they want the the big youtube channel and so they're more likely to come to you and build up your your channel to try and find out how you've done it but being aspirational is one of the ways that you can get people over. And ladies and gentlemen, if you target one or more of those things, you know, belief, aspirational, relatable, or you give someone something, then you are bound to grow. I have no doubt about it. No doubt about it whatsoever. And guys and girls, that is where I'm going to leave it. Thanks very much for watching. If you like this, then you know what to do. And if you really like this, then you also know what to do. If you want to see some more of my shit, you can check it out over there. Or over there. Or over there. <laughs> For now though, ride safe. Peace the fuck out.